So now we are going to create a start page. For the start page, we are going to create something like this. The game title in here and create a play button allow user to hit this button to load the game. So first of all, we are going to create a, a game title. Back to the Unity. In here, we set up the camera first to the to the white background. And uh, we don't need to maximize on play right now. We can do that later. And in here, we are going to create another object in here. Let's call it uh, create an empty object. And reset this to zero. And then let's call this object and manager for start page click on the project panel and go into the script folder right click on here to create your first script let's call it GUI control start after you done double click on this script to open the editor it will take a couple seconds to open Okay, when it's open, you can see if the script is a brand new script, you can see it will look like a like this. It only provides you the start function and the update function by default. So now we are going to create the title for the GUI first. The GUI will use a different function. We type in the function on GUI like this. So for the title, we are going to use GUI label rect and uh, put the position in here. This is the position for the X and this is the position for the Y and this is the size for the width the size for the height in here and we put the name for the game title in here this will be the game title image the 2d image so the game title will be the variable we will put this uh, game title or declare this game title in the front we will do that later. Don't forget the same on column. Okay, the position. Let's back to the to the image. So the position will be in here, and uh, for the GUI because it's screen based, the start point will start from zero zero to 
your device resolution. In this case, it's a 480 by 800. So this is the zero in the X, and this will be the 480 in here. Again, this is the zero for the Y, and this will be the 800 in here for the end point. So in this case, we are going to put uh, the game title in here, but uh, we will use the center as a reference. So we are going to put the screen dot width divided by 2, which is the center, start from the center. The screen width will get the width of your divide device so in this case it will be 224 uh, sorry 240 and the position will be screen uh, the position the ref the reference point for the y position will start from zero from the top so we just put a zero in here we will change the value later but uh, let's create the size first the size of the game title will be 256 by 128 you can put any size you want because we want to put it in the center so back to here we need to minus 128 the reason why we are doing that is because uh, this is the in here. This is the center of the width, which is the screen dot width divided two. But uh, earlier we were mentioned about uh, for the GUI image, it will start from the up left point, so will be in here. So if you want to display this game title in the center, we need to minus. 128 in this case because the whole image for the width is 256 let's get back to the editor and also for the height will be uh, let's put the 64 first so the 64 will be because the the reference point is from here so we're going down 64 pixels for this height let's hit save see what will happen go back to the unity you should see some error message yes because we didn't declare the variable in the editor yet I mean in the script yet so we need to create uh, this uh, game title before the start function this game title will be the texture so let's put VAR in here and put a game title and give a data type called the texture 2D and it should be fine right now yes and drag this script under the game star game manager star you will see the game title in here so let's go back that's going to create uh, the game title image in here and this will be the 256 by 128 let's say yes you can use any like a Photoshop or painter or anything you know to create an image you like Let's call it a tap to break. Change the size. Maybe like this size. Oh, okay. And here's safe. Make sure it's under your art assets folder. Let's call it again. 
title and the format that you can put for PNG. Wait, let me see. Uh, okay, uh, we need to make sure it's under your project folder, so it should be this one. Game title. Okay, let's go back to the Unity. Under the art assets, you should see this. Let's change the texture to GUI. Texture type to GUI. And leave everything as default. Don't forget to hit the apply. And drag the game title image to here. So let's uh, hit the play, see how it looks like. So we can see something here. Let's maximize the screen. So it's uh, about right in this position.